monster to me. No. But it doesn't mean she hasn't got one hiding inside of her. Go away. Don't. Don't look at me. Please. But why? He said... He said I'm fat and ugly. And that I should go and kill myself. Whoever said it, he's an idiot. No, he's right. <laughs> he's always right. I was a, I was a fool thinking you could ever fall in love with someone like me. <laughs> Fuck Harrison. You'll find someone better. You even understand love. There will never be anyone like him. He's an asshole. But without him, I'm nothing. Only one thing left to do. Oh, the only thing that comforts me. The only thing that's left. You're gonna eat. Yes, I'm gonna eat. Like a pig. Like a disgusting, hungry animal. I eat until the stupid, fat body explodes and scatters the room with my bloody dress. It doesn't have to be this way. Maybe. But. I've already made up my mind. So please, leave me alone now. I just want to sit here quietly a little longer before I <laughs> go away. Take your hands off my jacket, you asshole. How's the party? It's all good. Go ahead, man. Grab a beer. Like I did. You look like you've had one too many. Well, it's none of your fucking business, dude. You're right. It's not. Just between me and you, and the lovely bride over there, the birthday girl's got the huts for me, man. That girl's ass... That girl's ass is the size of a football stadium. I don't think I can do it without getting super wasted. You're a disgusting human being. Yeah, man. She is a disgusting human being. Hey, you wouldn't have a, a cigarette, would you? I'm all out and I'm fucking dying for a smoke. No. Sorry. Oh, fuck. Well, come back if... if you find one. I'll be right here. Agnes, can you keep him busy for a moment? Sure, but why? I want to take a look at his coat. But we can see it quite well from here. Yeah, but not inside the pockets. Hey there, got a moment? You will not believe what happened. I just have to tell someone about it. Now, if you stop talking for just a moment, sweetheart, how about I show you my room? I don't think so. Come on, girl. You know you want to. It's time to go, honey. Oh, pardon me. I didn't realize you two were a couple. But hey, if, if you get tired of him, you know where to find me. You okay? Right as rain, honey. I had to do something. That guy's a douchebag. I know. 
Thanks for stepping in. Honey. You're never gonna let this go, are you? Nope. Finally. I miss you. How much? Still less than I should. Never there, but somehow with me. You breathe. You love only me. Me, myself. No one. Is this gas I smell? Don't worry. I've got it under control.
it back. What is that supposed to mean? Well, I did take something from him. What? You don't want to know. Can you give it back? No, but now he's being a bitch about it. But isn't he dead? Somehow it didn't stop him from pulling that lever back. And I've got a feeling he'll do it again and again. So, if you can't give him what he wants, then maybe we can bring him something else instead. Yeah. Let's look around for a replacement. Poor Piggy. Don't start feeling sorry for it. It was born to die. Pigs are really intelligent, you know. Their brains are very similar to ours. A pig is a pig. That's all it is. There, I've brought it back. I've switched it on. Is this gas I smell? Don't worry. I've got it under control. Cigarette? Oh, fuck yeah. Hey man, you can't smoke here. See that sign? Are you for real? Who gives a shit? Look, you'll just trigger off the fire alarms and the sprinklers. Do we really want to get drenched? Well, that would ruin my hair. There's a bathroom just there. Go smoke in the bathroom. Now that's a great idea. Laters. Joe. At least he went out with a bang. Shut up, Joe. Just shut up.
Well done, Joe. I hope you're happy now. I... I had to do this. Yeah, yeah. I know. But did I tell you I'm allergic to human intestines splattered all around me? You are? Just do what you gotta do and tell me when we're out of here. And... Stay close, please? No, I'm not all right. What happened? I tripped over... some... legs. Harrison, always an asshole. Even after death. I don't really want to talk about it. Let's just go. Mind your head, Agnes. Ouch! Coast clear yet? It depends. It depends? It depends on what? It depends on how you feel about severed human heads. Not that good, to be perfectly honest. Then keep your eyes shut. We're almost done here. You're still not looking, are you? Why? Is it okay to look now? No. No. Nothing to see here. Nothing at all. So, you're cooking us dinner now? No. It's not for us. Oh, good. Good. Because they're not really meant to fry things in castor oil, you know. No? I think I'll try anyway. Hey, I found this fork in the house with all the coffins. You might want to use it for whatever you're doing there. Thanks. 
You're welcome. What you doing there, Joe? You don't want to know. Is that... is that a human head? If you don't like it, don't look. But... you can't! Watch me. Sorry for freaking out like that, but that grinding noise, it was too much. I know. But remember, we're doing this for Ivy. Yeah, I know. She'd better be worth it. Come on then, and don't forget to take your smoothie. She got spooked by the explosion in the bathroom. No, not spooked. Did you notice that Harrison's body went missing from the home? I bet it's got something to do with her. You think she took it? But where? Harrison's room? The one on the second floor? There's only one way to find out. Let's go. Ivy! You're alive! What's wrong with you? You look like you've seen a ghost. No. It's Ivy. Just there, on the floor. Really? Where? I can't see anything. She was there just a minute ago. I saw her. 
get torn in half. Joe, you're either losing the plot or... You really love her, don't you? It's complicated. Always is with relationships. How would you know? You don't even remember who you are. Don't be a dick. I was only trying to help. I'm sorry. I'm not used to talking about it. I... I don't really have many friends. It was always just me and Ivy and our stupid problems. It's okay. I understand. This bump? Sure. Visitors. You must forgive Harrison. He's feeling a bit poorly today. Sophie, this man is dead. Dead? <laughs> what do you mean? Well, it's just the legless carcass. Can't you see? Oh, sure, he's a little hurt. There's nothing a little bit of TLC won't cure, right? We've had a good talk, and he's promised to change his ways. Now, he will never walk away from me again. <laughs> Lucky you. I've got something for you. Oh, how nice! What is it? I've found this recipe for a smoothie. <gasps> My secret recipe! <laughs> I couldn't remember where I'd left it. Well, I've got it, and I made it for you. Sweet. It's been one crazy day. I'm ravenous. I... I should be on a diet, but... I can stop from tomorrow, right? Just don't tell Harrison. So good. Are you feeling all right? Yes. Wait, I... I don't know. I left a funny aftertaste in my mouth. Do you add all that Oh! Oof! My stomach! I feel... sick and... Bloated. What's happening to me? What have we done, Joe? We did what we had to do. 